Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Heidi Alaga. As former Vice President Mike Pence toured the border, the January 6th investigation also came up as a topic. Despite the invasion of the Capitol, Pence ignored pressure to set aside the Electoral College votes, which would have enabled a plan to help Donald Trump hold on to the presidency. Instead, he certified the votes, making Joe Biden president, while also earning him the anger of Trump and members of his own party. Kega 9 on your side's Craig Smith asked Pence today what he hopes the result of the January 6th investigation and hearings will be. What do you think will come out of that effort, that investigation? And what do you hope will come out of that effort? Well, January 6th was a tragic day. And, but thanks to the courage of law enforcement, uh, we secured the Capitol, uh, we restored order, uh, we were able to complete our duty under the Constitution of the United States of America. Penn says Americans will better understand what happened January 6th once all the information comes out. Besides issues like border security, Penn says he's looking forward to new leaders working for the country. So he's working to help candidates get elected to the House and Senate. Evacuations are expanding up near Flagstaff where a new wildfire is burning. The pipeline fire sparked just yesterday and has already burned nearly 5,000 acres. Officials say it's human caused and they've arrested someone for starting that fire. For some in this area, they're flashing back to April when they had to leave their homes for the tunnel fire. So many families back here and the whole idea behind being misplaced. And I mean, last time I was like uh, hopping hotel to hotel. Strong winds in the area have been hampering firefighting efforts. Today, of course, we'll continue to monitor that fire and keep you updated. A Tucson baker famous for his bread is a James Beard Award winner. Don Guerra of Barrio Bread is a recipient of the Outstanding Baker Award. This is the third nomination to the James Beard Awards. Congratulations to the talented baker. Well, extreme heat has backed off just a little across southern Arizona, but temperatures are still plenty hot. Highs will hover close to 105 degrees through Wednesday, but will jump back to 111 for Thursday. Excessive heat watches have been posted for Thursday, but relief is on the way. A nice surge of monsoon moisture will return to southern Arizona. Arizona and bring a good chance of thunderstorms for Friday and Saturday.